Hello everyone, welcome. This is Feline Intuition 1111. This is going to be a collective reading. Let's see what messages want to come out for you. Oops. What are the messages for the collective? Oh my goodness. So we got snake, crossroads, social media and secret crush. This is interesting already. Okay. What is going on here? You have a secret crush. Most likely it's online. But let's see. What are the messages? Oh my goodness. Diamond in the rough. Sweeping things under the rug. <laughs> we have... I always feel like someone's watching me. Be careful of fake pages. So there's something going on online for you. There's like a secret crush and there's also some kind of hater type of energy as well. So we got two energies showing up. We have side eye, someone acting like they got amnesia. A line of questioning is needed. If they brought it to you, they were talking about you too. So something is going on. Let's see what it is. What are the messages for the collective? What are the messages for the collective? Messages, okay. Let's see. Okay. Got Aries and Leo energy. Some of you could be getting over a breakup or someone is trying to get over a breakup, like the mental conflict surrounding a breakup. There's Libra energy as well. And there's this King of Wands. And we have this Emperor in Reverse. So there was someone who feels like they lost control of you, like you're no longer giving to them. Why is this emperor here in reverse? It could be multiple people who feel like, because it gives me like this karmic energy, or it could be an ex, or it could be like friends, family members who you don't talk to anymore because maybe they were secretly envious of you. We do have the snake card. So it's like there is this overall feeling for these people that they've lost control of you, that you're fully independent now. You don't need them. They can't manipulate you. We have the five of swords. So you definitely realize that you are a diamond in the rough. And it's really agitating, I guess, karmic people. Why the sun in reverse? Yeah, it's like they feel like you're outshining them. These could be people who tried to get you to dim your light, but you did not let it happen. You swayed away from these people, moved away from them. Why the seven of pentacles in reverse? Yeah, devil. This is karmic energy. So whether it's an ex or a or family or friends. These are the people who try to hold you back in some way. They could be getting really bad karma now. They could be dealing with a lot of issues. Why are the two of cups in reverse? Why are the nine of swords in reverse? Could be dealing with the Aquarius, Capricorn. There might be someone who tries to reconcile with you only because they're wanting to feel better about a breakup. But there's this energy of you coming out as a star after a breakup, like really healing. Oh my gosh. Sorry about that. Some of the cards fell. Why justice? Why is justice here? King of Cups in reverse. Yeah, these people or, or this person, they're getting karma. Two of Swords in reverse. Could be a Virgo, Cancer. 
they're getting karma and it's like you yeah this this is about you realizing who you are realizing your power or how they tried to control you or how a person tried to control you in a relationship maybe they did it in a sneaky way like try to lower your self-esteem or play hard to get to get you to be hooked on them but whatever it is you've you've figured it out or you're going to and they're getting some bad karma whoever these people are or this person is and at the same time, you're coming out of a hermit mode and you are branching out is what I'm hearing. So I don't know what you're doing. Maybe it's something to do with work or just your appearance or everything it could be. But you're seeing a lot now or you're going to be seeing how things work for you, how things can work for you. And these people are experiencing major setbacks. So let me look at the main spread. We still have this secret crush energy to uncover. But there's definitely some snakes. They could be also watching your page with fake accounts. These people. Okay. What are the messages for the collective? Messages for the collective. People are realizing that you've gained a lot of wisdom. Wow. Page of Swords. You definitely have people watching you, whether it's in real life, well, in person or online, it could be both. But they see that you've gained a lot of wisdom because they're seeing you as a hierophant. They feel like you know everything that they've been hiding. Um, the tower is a fear of theirs. Hold on a sec. Why the nine of pentacles? there's someone someone's been slowing down in some way because they're wishing to have what you have and it's actually making them really upset something has slowed down for somebody here why the knight of pentacles in reverse someone feels like i don't know if they feel like it's because of you but things are moving slow for them like they're not i don't know there's something slowing down for this person and it is really making them upset and it's like they're seeing you in this nine of pentacles hierophant energy that you've gained wisdom and you're just getting everything you want but there's also something about a person as well. With this King of Cups. Hold on, clarify the Hierophant, please. Two of Cups. There's something about a love situation as well. The Secret Admirer could find you to be very knowledgeable. But they're scared to make a move or they see you as being scared to make a move but they see some kind of connection with you especially if you're talking to someone now like you're in a talking stage they see you as very intelligent wise but they feel like you're holding back when it comes to flirting or showing your true feelings and they want a connection with you why the four of swords
someone yeah this could be an ex or maybe ex friend but someone feels like your relationship with them is on hold while you're kind of taking leaps some of you could be traveling a lot they see you as just doing all kinds of new <laughs> new and exciting things in your life while things with them are just at a standstill like things between you and them so it could be an ex who feels that way or a ex-friend why the tower is definitely someone you used to do things with or include in your plans yeah there's a fear that you it's someone feels like you found out the truth about them that they're a snake clarify the snake card please who is this the empress hold on who's a snake could be an Aries Leo Sagittarius it could be an ex of yours who is a snake maybe they were secretly jealous of you could be to do with money that they were jealous of your money but there's like a male figure here who is fake for some of you they could be pretending to have more money than they have clarify this knight of swords please yeah someone feels like i know the messages are all over the place it keeps going from person to person but the the, the person who feels like they're slowing down in life they feel like it's they could feel like it's because of you because things are moving very quickly for you and they feel like they're not shining they're not getting their recognition they could be blaming you or they could just be comparing themselves to you Why the Four of Pentacles? Magician Reverse again. Careful of someone manipulative because this is someone's next move. Careful, especially in love as well. If an ex tries to come back, if they're toxic, they could be trying to manipulate you to keep you stuck with them or to get you stuck on them. Someone's planning to do something manipulative. It's either because they're greedy and they want what you have and they're trying to manipulate you out of it or it's a love situation for some of you there could be someone who wants somebody that you're with as well with the lovers in reverse someone trying to be at the party in your situation maybe it's your person's ex or just someone who likes them or it could be your ex why the four of cups in reverse someone's you see position of what you need to know is someone who wasn't accepting your love your offer and everything you had to give to them is going to be accepting or coming towards you but they're they got this devil energy so it could be this king of wands male or female it could be this person maybe they're maybe the person you were with was secretly jealous now they're coming in but it's manipulative they they have something up their sleeve five of swords as well so they could be linked to this as well. They could have been involved in gossip about you. So be careful of someone who just isn't doing as well as you're doing because there seems to be a jealousy situation going on here. And they could be wearing a mask. Why the page of wands? Again, with the five of swords. Six of swords. Yeah, I see you just moving away from all this drama and conflict and fakeness. Some of you are starting something new and creative. I see you um, not really going against these people or giving them any energy. I see you putting your energy into some kind of new creative thing that you're doing or into yourself, your appearance, your healing. But whatever, whatever it is, you're just using your energy wisely and that's actually going to allow you to win in the situation even though you're not battling them directly you're doing it um wisely you're seeing how putting your energy into something better can help than to put it into you know involving yourself in whatever these people are trying to do so let's see still not much about the secret crush but we'll clarify it what are the messages for the collective? 
Shocking. Turmoil, trouble, unexpected. Heart fog, mixed signals, blocked emotions, messed up. Open heart, receptive, empathy, vulnerable. Rejection, abandoned, dismissed. Irrational fear. Your ex feels abandoned and dismissed. Why is mixed signals here? What is this about? Careful of a narcissistic person who sends mixed signals. They could have multiple options and blocked emotions. So yeah, careful of someone who doesn't have emotions and just gives mixed signals. They seem narcissistic and just they have options. Clarify the secret crush, please. Hmm. Could be someone you know. Someone who wants to come out of conflict with you. I don't know why for some of you I'm getting that. It could be a friend as well. What's the fake pages? What's going on with the fake pages? Someone you don't want to talk to is making fake pages. That could be why they're making the fake page because they know you don't want to see them or talk to them. They're trying to get over you. They feel like if they come towards you as themselves that you're not going to want to speak to them. You're going to reject them. So they're watching. This does look like an ex, honestly. What are the messages? Promises. Death, rebirth. Transformation is happening for you. We got yeah, mask not their true self. I don't even know who this is. It could be the ex, but I'm worried for some of you that it could be someone new. Just be careful of narcissistic people or anyone who shows mixed signals. They could be wearing a mask. Yeah, options, multiple choices. Careful of someone who's giving you mixed signals, and they could have. Multiple choices. They could just be a time waster. Siren, temptation, the lurker, spying. So someone is definitely watching you and I don't really... I mean, it could be more than one person. But... Hmm. Pray for the mask card, please. Tower. Is there someone who's two time in or they have options? For some of you, this could be your ex and you could already know and you could have already left them because of that. But I just hope it's not anyone new. Clarify the temptation. Yeah, there's a deceptive person. It could be your ex, because we have the Eight of Cups in reverse, someone who's returning. They are definitely a game player, mind game player with the Temptation, Siren card. So I guess if your ex is extremely attractive and tempting for you, it's them. Because it's like there's someone trying to use their looks, their tactics, to get to you. I cannot even figure out who is who in this reading anymore. I just know that there is a snake and there is a there's a snake slash narcissist person showing up here who wants to come towards you or come back. What are the messages? Dark hair, intense focus. Ice King, Boss Entrepreneur, Detached. Yeah, there's a detached person that you're needing to be careful of. Soulmate, Great Connection, Karma, Toxic Story, New Opportunities. If 
someone seems emotionless, <laughs> just avoid them. If it was your ex who was emotionless, then, then it's your ex. But someone comes towards you. Be cautious. Clarify Ice King, please. They could have a very changey personality, like unpredictable. Unpredictable behavior. But they definitely have a lot of fears and they're stuck in their head and that's why they just kind of want to detach from their emotions. They feel safer that way. This person has a lot of unhealed trauma basically is what I'm seeing. Messages for the collective. Triggers. Never again. I was disillusion and inconsistencies. Yeah, for some of you, this could be speaking about an ex. So if it is, then not to worry. You already know who they are. Because you're already saying never again. This person could have triggered you a lot. Disillusioned you. And was inconsistent. Because we have mixed signals. Inconsistent. Mask. So you would know who this is if you've dealt with this already. But still be cautious of whoever comes towards you. Um, let's see. Messages for the collective. Give plus receive. Trust. Pillow talk and fresh start. Yeah, there's just like mini energy of a new love. But it's rarely coming out. This is more like warning you about someone toxic. Who wants to come back, manipulate you, play games. They could be attractive, tempting. Could have dark features, dark hair. They could have an intense look. Seductive look. Tempting look. Um, let's see. All right. Love messages. Burning desire, flames of passion ignite. Workplace romance, common cause, connection. Marriage, wedding bells are ringing and twin flame recognition. You know this soul that mirrors your own. So Someone you could meet at work or you're already with them. Or you have a lot of com a lot in common. But I feel like a lot of you are going into a connection. That's how you're being seen. Going into a commitment, going into a relationship. But the person themselves may feel like they don't know how you feel. Like you're not showing them your feelings. It's like you're not show telling them that you like them or you know there's some hesitation clarify sweeping things under the rug yeah someone wants to come out the cold but they want to sweep things under the rug they don't want to take accountability take ownership they just want things like the past to be washed away so they can have another chance with you it does look like the narcissistic person. Clarify the side eye card. The emperor. Empress in reverse. Queen of cups in reverse. So someone's been... They could have been listening to someone gossip about you. Hmm. One more. I feel like someone who's emotionally like insecure like they're insecure and they're very 
emotionally imbalanced. This person could have been listening to something they were saying about you. So your ex could have been listening to something that some weird, jealous person was saying. Someone at their workplace could be talking about you or someone from your workplace, but it's like they, that's if you work, that's if you go out to work or wherever you spend time, it could be gym, wherever you would spend time where there's people around, but someone has said something. So this person may come to you with information, but it seems like they were involved. They do have narcissistic tendencies, so I wouldn't be surprised. And they do seem somewhat envious of you and what you have. Clarify the social media card, please. There's multiple people looking at your social media, talking about, so they could be sharing posts and talking about it in some type of message, joint message, group chat. Could be people from your workplace. Doesn't have to be, but it's definitely a group of people Could be people that you rejected or someone someone's involved in this situation that you rejected why the crossroads someone's gonna yeah someone's disappointed because you may have chosen someone over them or someone could have chosen you over them and they're disappointed and unhappy so they could be the one gossiping about you i'm hearing ven Data. So someone may have something against you because of you being chosen by someone or you just having more than them or again them blaming you for why things are not working out for them. Something about that. And they're watching. Why are they watching? They're jealous. Knight of Cups in reverse, and they're insecure, Empress in reverse, and they don't like to work hard for things. So it looks like a victim mentality this person has, where they blame you for everything that's wrong in their life, so they're watching you. So weird to make an account to watch someone just for that, just for that reason. Let's see. Give me a time frame for when this could unfold. In a few months, I'm getting that you will start to see these people like their identities. In a few months, we have stop obsessing first. March on a holiday. Some of you could be traveling, could be hearing about things when you travel. But I feel like when it comes to love, there might be a need to stop obsessing. Some of you have an ideal person in mind. This is for those of you who haven't found love yet. Okay, clarify in a few months. So in a few months, you're gonna be shining and somebody's going to be going the opposite direction. You're shining, they're not, and they are looking to you because they feel like it's because of you that they're not shining, or maybe you're taking the attention away from them. It could be at work or at, you know, wherever you go or online. But it's like you're, they feel like, I don't know, this person just doesn't believe. They just don't take accountability. They are kind of obsessed with watching other people comparing themselves and feeling low. So this person could be watching you, an ex could be watching you. I should do a, who, a who's watching you reading because this one is just a lot to do with some kind of fake accounts. I feel like it's multiple people. I do feel like a toxic ex is trying to come back 
to manipulate you. And those are the main things here. It's more like beware of all these people. You would know who they are. Maybe you can pick up on this. There could be some people that you're shocked to find out are snakes. But you'll see who's who. So could be a Capricorn, a Gemini, Leo, Aries. We had Aquarius, Virgo, Libra, okay. those are the main signs, there's Taurus as well, so those are the main signs, I hope this was helpful, thank you guys. So much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.